carb cycling or cyclo-ketogenic diets are diets where you, in general, eat low-carb, high-fat, moderate protein, but there are certain days during the week when you eat high carbohydrates. Uh, the very first example that I can think of is the steak and eggs diet by Vince Garanda, also known as the meat, eggs, and water diet. It was a very popular diet being used in the 70s by bodybuilders, and the idea was you would eat nothing but meat, eggs, and water, which is another name for the steak and eggs diet, two to three meals a day, and every three to four days you would have a high-carb meal, let's say like a bowl of pasta, a bowl of rice, something like that. And um, back in the 70s, a lot of the guys would do something different. They would basically go, instead of every three to four days have a meal, they would have an entire day of carbohydrates, basically like a cheat day, once a week, okay? And if you want to find out more about that, look up Rick Drayson's channel on YouTube. He talks about it. He was never a bodybuilder in the 70s, but he was a professional wrestler who used to lift weights with all Franco, Arnold, all the guys in um, Gold's Gym back in the 70s to prepare for his professional wrestling. So anyway, that's the way they would do it. About 20 years later, there was another diet called the anabolic diet that um, has the same idea. Low carbs, high fat, five days a week. This one had you going two full days with carbohydrates on the weekends. Now, why, why should you do this? Okay, there are a couple different reasons. One of them is, like I said, Vince Garanda said, you know, your, your muscles go flat, so you need glycogen to pump them up again. That's one of the reasons. Another reason is a lot of people, when they go on the low-carb diet, they have a problem with their, uh, with their workouts, okay? They don't feel like they're getting the same pump the same intensity, they lose strength, whatever. I personally have never had a problem with that because that's just the way my body works. If I get in enough fat, my testosterone levels go up, my muscles are pumped all the time, my strength increases on a regular basis, I feel great during my workouts. But if you're one of those people who has this problem where you, you know, if you stay on a, a low carb diet for a while, you feel like you're losing, uh, you're, you're not making progress in the gym or even losing progress, you might want to try a cyclic ketogenic diet, okay? So those are two reasons, to replace your muscle glycogen so you're pumped, to replace your muscle glycogen so you can uh, work out with the same intensity. And another reason is there's, there's a physical, I have a physical addiction, like an actual substance abuse problem with sugar. And a lot of people have at least a psychological addiction to carbs and sugar, okay? So like the guy who wrote the uh, anabolic uh, diet book said, you know, if you want to hang out and have a couple beers with the guys, do it on your day when you're eating, when you're having more carbohydrates. You know, if you want to hang out and, you know, eat a pizza or, you know, have a cake or something with somebody or a piece of pie, go ahead and do it on your high carb day. So that basically allows you to be a little bit social at least one day during the week. Now, how exactly do you do this? You need to find out how your body works, okay? Um, you know, it may be counterintuitive, but believe it or not, when I was doing this, and I got some pretty good results on the steak and eggs diet, I really felt best taking in simple sugars, okay? If I were to sit down and eat a meal of complex carbohydrates, I would feel like, you know, I still don't have any carbs in my system and I have to, you know, digest all this food and, you know, I still, it still wasn't the same thing. Whereas if I were to say, you know, with, for instance, one of the things I would do is I'd wake up in the morning and I'd have like, you know, just a small like container of like glazed donuts, these little donuts you buy them in a small bag at Walmart, you know, or, or donut holes or whatever. I'd have like a small bag of that and, you know, some, some coffee with real sugar and real creamer in it, okay? And that would be my breakfast. And then at lunch, you know, I might have, I don't know, I might have a sandwich. I might have, you know, some muffins or something like that. And then at dinner, you know, I might have some pasta or some noodles or I might have like a pizza or whatever. And that was it. You know, I didn't really go overboard, okay? But like I said, you need to find out what it is that you like. So, you know, if you really miss eating fruits, uh, if you really miss drinking fruit juice, drinking soda, having beers, go ahead and try doing that on your uh, carb refeed day. Or some other people might do better with more complex carbohydrates. You just need to see what works for you. How much should you eat? Like I said, in the um, anabolic diet book, the guy basically gave you some guidelines 
But like everything else in diet, he said you had to figure out for yourself what works for you. And basically, if you start to feel like you're stuffing yourself, like you didn't, you're not filling up your glycogen anymore, you're not you know, replenishing your body's blood sugar anymore, what you're doing is basically just stuffing yourself, that's the time to back down. And like I said, some people can, you know, according to his book, some people can have two full days of carbohydrates a week. Some people can only have a day and a half or a day or even a meal. So it really depends upon the person. But like I said, when I was on the steak and eggs diet, the best thing that I did is one day, you know, two to three meals of simple carbohydrates. And that was it. And like I said, when you feel like you're stuffing yourself, then you stop. Now, there is an alternative, and I'm going to talk about this in the next video, which is carb timing, where you eat carbohydrates every single day, but at very specific times and in very specific amounts.